Hey everyone, today I just wanted to make this quick video to help you fix your Nest thermostat if you're seeing a red blinking light, a low power warning, or maybe your screen just stays dark and doesn't turn on. It's a pretty common problem and usually an easy fix once you know what to check. So let's go through it step by step. Go ahead and pull the thermostat off its base. You'll notice a small charging port on the back. Depending on your model, it could be a micro USB, mini USB, or USB-C. Take a regular phone charger and plug it in. Let it charge for at least 8 to 10 hours. Overnight is even better. Once charged, pop it back on the wall and see if it powers up normally. If the screen lights up and responds, your Nest just wasn't getting enough power from your system. If it still doesn't turn on, move to step 2. That red wire, labeled R or RHRC, supplies the main power from your HVAC system to the thermostat. Make sure it's fully inserted into the terminal on the Nest base. If it looks fine, the next thing to check is down at your furnace or air handler. Sometimes there's a blown fuse on the control board that cuts off power to the thermostat. Replace the fuse if needed, then see if the Nest powers back on. If everything looks good but it's still not responding, go to your breaker panel and flip the breaker for your furnace or HVAC system off and back on a few times. This can reset the control board and restore power to the red wire connection. Now, if you've tried everything above and your Nest keeps losing power or showing a low battery, the issue might be that your system doesn't have a common wire or C wire. The C wire provides a steady 24 volt connection that keeps the Nest charged all the time. If your setup doesn't have one, you might need to run a C wire from your furnace to the thermostat or use a C wire adapter kit if you prefer an easier option. Once that's connected, your Nest will stay powered consistently and you shouldn't see the red light or low power issue again. And that's it. And don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more quick home tech fixes.